So now let's take a look at making this QCasts directory visitable in the browser. So let's open up that Homestead YAML file again. And if we take a look at the section under sites, you can see that we're mapping QCast.test to this location on our Vagrant machine. So you might think, well, hey, all I need to do is visit QCast.test in my browser and that should work. But no, unfortunately, you also have to map the domain or you have to map this domain to uh, your Etsy hosts file, and then you also have to access this on port 8000. So let's show you guys how to do that. So I'm going to open up a new tab in my terminal, and I'm going to type in sudo vim Etsy hosts. And that beginning uh, forward slash is really important because it's going to go to the root directory of your actual computer. So let's hit enter. It's going to ask you for your password. So go ahead and put that in. And then what you need to do is uh, move the cursor down. And because this is Vim, uh, yeah, it's a little bit tricky to edit in, but I'm gonna hit I to insert, jump to a new line, and then let's type in uh, 127.0.0.1, and let's map QCasts.test to that IP. So now QCasts should be running on my local computer. If I just hit escape, colon and WQ to save with writing and quitting. So Vim is notoriously difficult to quit. But uh, yeah, if you ever find yourself in a situation where you're stuck in Vim, it's escape colon WQ and that's going to quit Vim. Okay, with saving, by the way, if you want to quit without saving, it's escape colon WQ exclamation mark. Right, so now we have edited our hosts file. Uh, so if I go back over to the browser and I type in qcast.test and I run this on port 8000, uh, I should have a visible Laravel website. And yeah, from here, I can obviously open that project up and we can start editing that. But I will leave that for an entire series on Laravel. And that is the end of the video. So if you made it this far, there's a couple things that you can do to help me. First of all, subscribe, leave a like, leave a comment saying something nice, hopefully. Share this video with your friends because all of that stuff is going to help my channel grow. And I'm also feeling a little lonely. So don't forget to follow me on social media.